Good morning, super cool party people. I'm awake. I was having this really weird dream just before I woke up that I was like in this training program. And fighting? I, I'm not really sure, but it's like I was about to go sleep with my roommate. I think my roommate was blind or faking it to make to get sympathy within this program because it's a very intensive program and she seemed i don't know she seemed like she could see too well to be blind if that makes any sense but we were like about to go to sleep and then she's like oh crap it's so and so training and i was like are you kidding me because it was like in my dream it was like five in the morning or something so like she gets up and runs out Hence why now that I look back retrospectively, I'm like, was she actually? Anyway, um, and then, like I got ready and like I go to the room and I get into the room and it's like pitch black. I just like see her go out a door and hear it close. And I'm like, mm, this doesn't feel right. I should get myself out of here. And then I like go to go out the door behind me and it gets locked. And so I'm locked in this pitch black room. But I had my phone with me. So I just kind of called security and they let me out. But then I was like, I think somebody's out to get me. So I spent some time, I went back in the room and I like figured out a way to like pry up the floor so I could get out of it that way if that happened again. But yeah, it was a really interesting dream. It was like weird stuff going on and like not enough sleep in my dream, which I think is just sleep imitating life. But yeah, no, I could definitely use a couple more hours of sleep, but what can you do? I am obviously at work now. I think it's gonna be another busy day because after work, I think my grandparents are picking me up. We need to go to the free store, which is their storage locker. That's what we call it. Um, and I think we're meeting up with my cousin's girlfriend to help buy something for my cousin for Christmas, for her to help my grandma buy something for him for Christmas. Complicated, I know. I did spend a little bit more time with my query letter last night, which is good. I think the main thing is, is I need, I have a paragraph it's like this book is set in Illyria and I kind of need to figure out a way to explain what Illyria is better than I have currently done. So maybe I'll try to brainstorm that while I'm working today. I have rambled a lot. I need to go have my breakfast drink and also take off this toque because I was super, super hot while I was sleeping last night. And I like, I don't know. I was just like trying to get to bed and I was like, is there a heater in my bed? Because it'd be like just spots of me that were like, I'm really warm. So I'm afraid I might be getting sick. Hopefully not. Alrighty, so I'm home from work now. My grandparents picked me up. We met up with my cousin's girlfriend to go for a quick bite to eat. And then we went to the store to buy something for my cousin with her input. So I think we're good. Got it for my grandma. My grandma got it for him. <laughs> complicated. I'm going to now jump into that shower that is long overdue and I should have had like yesterday it was long overdue so I don't know what it is today but it's definitely necessary. <laughs> keys. Gotta put the keys where they belong or I'll forget them. So yeah that's the plan right now um, and I don't know I think we go to storage unit later to get some stuff for my grandparents but it's really windy out there like it's super stormy so I it, it wouldn't go well. It's a very exposed door, so we it would just, yeah. So anyways, I'm gonna jump in the shower now, and I'll check in with you after, probably. Hey Google, pause music. I, my room, again, I'm clean, but like, <laughs> can't, I don't even know how this happens, but most important thing is putting this hoodie on. I said I was gonna live in it, I wasn't lying. Um, still very windy. I feel a lot more alive though. I think I'm gonna see what they're doing upstairs and if it's nothing super important, I'm gonna come back down here and make my bed and tidy my room and put away laundry and all that kind of fun stuff. Okay, we are put back together, bed is made, floor is clean. I mean, my backpack's there, but I still haven't quite figured out where I wanna keep it all the time. And now I think it's time to head upstairs and get the chicken marinating. Cause yeah, I think I'm gonna do honey garlic chicken for dinner should be good yay all right so exciting news jessica finished reading my book it was so funny she texted me at like 802 and she was like i'm almost done reading your book and i was like oh that's awesome and i was like texted with her for a second and i was gonna ask her where she was and then she's like i'm done your book <laughs> like seven minutes later i was like okay you were that close so she's finished reading it so i got a little bit of feedback from her and 
much more helpfully I was like she's like do you have a title yet I was like no I don't she's like what about this or what about this or what about this so she's giving me a ton of suggestions for not just the first book but the other four that she hasn't read so that's very exciting so fingers crossed that one of them will stick there's like two different ways I could go with this so either left or right I think they're both good choices it's just gonna be a matter of which one so I'm going to put them up on the wall and stare at them for a while until I decide which one I like I like it Okay, so it is just about midnight, but I've been sitting here staring at this. I'm not going to show you the other side. Um, and I think, other than book three, I think I've got it figured out. That's so exciting. Book three is kind of important. It's in the middle. Um, but I texted what I figured out to, my, to Jessica, who was helping me with the titles. And I was like, this is kind of the vibe of book three. Like, this is kind of what I'm going for. Like, can you come up with a word that starts with an E? <laughs> we're going with E's. I've decided we're going with E's. Um, I think I'll probably reveal the title in tomorrow's vlog. But for a sneak peek, check out my blog because I just wrote a post that's going to go up at um 11 35 because i like weird times today so like once this is up at 11 35 that day i talk about my vlog my, my book title my book title um in my vlog so feel free to check that out. it's linked down below but yeah with that i think i'm gonna go to sleep now because that's the thing but things are very exciting i'm like really feeling pretty good my query letter is getting there um i have other exciting stuff about my book that I'm not going to share right now. I, I don't have an agent. It's just sort of right there. I'm not published, but it's getting, it's getting exciting. So this is great. This is great. Anyways, with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on today's adventure and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.